This is gonna be the most common helmet in youth football. This is a five-star rated, available in person nationwide, and is only $210. So what is it? It's the Zenith X2E. This is not gonna be the most popular helmet in the NFL by far, but that's only 2,000 guys. And yes, it's not gonna be the most popular helmet in the NCAA, but that's around another 73,000 guys. But it can be the most popular helmet in youth football, which is over five million people across the US between the ages of six to 18. Even if you take out the high school students, it's still four million. Now, like we talked about in the shoulder pad video, not every youth team you play on is gonna provide you all the equipment you need. And sometimes the team you are playing on, their gear is really old, smelly, stinky, and you just don't know how well it's been taken care of. Now, yes, a helmet can be recertified twice, which means a helmet can last you up to 10 years, but sometimes a parent still doesn't trust that. Now, before we go any further in this video, we do wanna say this video is sponsored by Zenith. They did send us this helmet. And if you do wanna pick up the X2E for yourself, it's available nationwide at Dick Sporting Goods, and you can also pick it up online. We'll leave links down below. So yeah, this helmet's not gonna be super popular on Sundays, and frankly, only a couple guys in the NFL currently wear Zenith. But here are the reasons why we see it becoming so popular in youth football. Number one is gonna be safety. This is a Virginia Tech five-star rated helmet, just like all the other big three helmets on the market. Speedflex, Shut F7, Vices, they're all five-star rated helmets. And when you look at their actual score, yes, they are a little bit lower, but the five-star rating says that this helmet is safe to wear on any football field and you should have no reservations about wearing it. Also to compare, this X2E might even be more popular than some of the helmets you have up there, like the basic Riddell Speedflex, or even the Zenith Shadow, it's big brother. Number two is gonna be availability. And yeah, this is another big one for me. When you're trying on a helmet, it is really hard to figure out what you want by just trying it online, seeing how it looks, maybe measuring your circumference of your head and seeing what would fit. The reality is with helmets, you need to try them on in person and always going into a store can sometimes be really tricky to find other brands. Like I said, the Zenith X2E is available at Dick Sporting Goods. I highly recommend if you are gonna buy your own helmet, Go into store, maybe you take a measurement of your head beforehand so you kind of know what you're getting yourself into or use Zenith as resources. And then from there, try it on, see how it fits, try a medium, try a large, try a couple different sizes and make sure you're getting one that fits your head and one you're comfortable with. And it is important to note that not every helmet fits every head shape. In the past, I've seen shut helmets fitting better for guys with long skinny heads, where Riddell fits a little better for guys with a little bit thicker heads. That's why it's so important to go into store, make sure this thing fits, make sure it's comfortable for your head shape. All right, this is arguably gonna be the biggest one, price. Now we talk a lot about helmets on this channel and frankly, they keep getting more and more expensive. And that's not to knock on those brands because they are aimed at the pros and solving problems happening at the professional level. Zenith is targeting youth football, which means they're targeting a much lower price point. Now yeah, Zenith is a sponsor of this video, but when I actually went on Dick Sporting Goods and noticed that this helmet was only $209, that's like literally the cheapest thing you can get on the market. And with its safety and its comfort and stuff, it's a really good deal. For price alone, I see this becoming really attractive to parents because they're always concerned that their kid's head is gonna grow. And within six months, the helmet they bought them is already gonna not fit them anymore. When they spend six or $700, on a helmet, it's gonna be really justified going to buy another one. But with this price point, it's like a fifth of the Vices, it's half of the Shut F7 or the Riddell Speedflex. So this $200 price point is honestly like the best in the game for you could get for your helmet for yourself off the shelf. This whole month is brought to you guys by Q Collar. The Q Collar is revolutionary technology proven to help protect the brain from the effects of repetitive impacts that you likely aren't thinking about when you play, but they do add up over time. I'm not going to get too deep into the woods on the science side here because we did a whole video last year breaking down why so many NFL players are starting to wear it. And you can see even more guys have adopted it to keep their head in the game and to keep themselves safe. These days, getting a brand new helmet can cost over $1,000, which is not easy for a lot of you guys to do. And the Q Collar protects the brain in the way that helmets just can't. If you are interested in taking further steps to help protect your future with the Q Collar, visit Q30.com. That's Q30.com. Enjoy the rest of the video. The next one is gonna be comfort. Now, if you're getting your kid into football, you wanna make sure they have something on their head that is comfortable and they're gonna to wanna to make sure they leave on their head. Like we've talked about in the past, the Zenith helmet is extremely comfortable. One of our favorite features is gonna be the chin strap. With the chin strap, it actually connects at the top and side like a normal chin strap. However, there's a third point of contact that when you tighten the chin strap, it tightens around the back of your head and gives you a really unique feel. It kind of corrals the back of your head and gives you a really nice custom fit. But my one word of caution will be, watch out for these little pucks on the inside because if you do have long hair, sometimes your hair can get stuck between these pucks and when you take it off you're gonna have to pull your hair out and it can hurt a little bit so if you do have really long hair with this definitely recommend like a do-rag skull cap something to keep your hair down and out of it next one reliability now like all the helmet companies out there zenith's goal is to give you the best helmet with the best materials on the market at a price point that any athlete can afford and for that reason alone dick sporting goods has invested in a strategic partnership with zenith which means this helmet isn't going anywhere anytime soon so that's it those are all the different reasons you might want to consider picking up the zenith x2e for yourself if you are playing youth football again this helmet is available in store and online with dick's Sporting goods. Again, I'll check you next time.